So let's talk first about how to prepare to film. At this point, you should have a script and a plan already laid out, and now you've also set some time aside to actually film. Now it's time to get ready to film. A common mistake people will make is not reviewing their equipment. If you're filming in the morning, then review your equipment the night before. If you're filming that afternoon, make sure to check things that morning. Here's what to look for when you're checking. First, check the batteries. Make sure all batteries are charged and working properly. Next, if you're using the Osmo, review your SD card and make sure that the footage from your past shoot is uploaded to your computer, then reformat your SD card. Reformatting before a shoot can prevent files from being corrupted. and It'll also give you access to all the space available on your card. If you're filming on your phone, do the same thing. Clear up as much space as you can and charge your phone. If you're traveling to a remote location to film, it helps to maybe have a backup power source as well. Check your props. Anything you'll be using while you're, you're filming should be working, packed, and ready to go. Before your shoot, set up your equipment and run a couple test shots. It only takes a few minutes to set up everything and going through this process really helps you take inventory. If you've misplaced like an accessory, then you'll know it right away and you'll, and you'll save from having those occasions where you're like, oh no, where is it? Now that your equipment is set up and you have everything you need, then this is a great time to review your script and practice your shots. Go through the motions, get out there and start filming. Even practice hitting the record button and using the microphone as well. It doesn't hurt to know what to expect. You can always delete these video files after. Practice how the people you plan to film will fit in the screen. Imagine how close or how far you'll need to be. Think about how the people will move in and out of the camera scene. Which way should, you, should the camera face? Consider different perspectives that you can capture in order to clearly tell your story and intrigue your audience. Try a few different angles and make note of what good ones you like. If you get stuck and don't have a good idea on how to best film something, jump on YouTube and search best commercials. Watch the pros and see what they're doing. Now, a famous advertiser that I used to study, David Ogilvy, once said that when you're new, the best place to start is by copying what the pros do. Now, note, I'm not suggesting that you plagiarize, but instead take these basic ideas and techniques from other experts and incorporate them into what you're filming. 